This is Twit. Ah, here's the home part. Oh, here we go. Home automation. This is very big stuff. This iOS 8, huge. Yeah. There are Apple's a lot doing of the right home thing. Home automation devices coming on the market these days, and they have companion apps, things like lights, my hue, and door locks, it's the, uh, webcams, quick set. garage doors, and thermostats. But you know, no each Nest. of them have their own application. <laughs> That's the honey And they end up defining their own network protocol, their own security mechanisms. Well, we thought we could bring some rationality to this space. Yes, you could. We started working with the leaders in home automation devices. Mm. And we've so come I up devices, with iHome home kit free. With a common TI. network protocol that has secure pairing to ensure that only your iPhone. They're going to do their own protocol. This is the end of Zigbee. This is the end of, the end of all end of, the other standards. This is Siri integration. Individual oh, devices oh, oh. in your home. With HomeKit, you can group I devices think I just bought a new and changes iPhone. into scenes. Oh, yeah. And then smokes. with Siri integration. Hey, Siri, open the garage door. Yeah. yeah. <sighs> Huge. Siri, turn on the living room lights. Your door is locked. The thermostat is lowered and your lights are dimmed. That's HomeKit. Now, I, I want to know what about inter interoperability. It, it, People have invested quite a bit in home automation and may not work with them. I still think it's that that's been a nation market so far. I mean, I, I think yeah, you're right. They this could just take it over.